After two years of working from home and working remotely, I've never been more excited to be in a room with other people. How do I think the five days went? Awesome. I had no idea what I was in for. We've been working on this product together. We've been talking for probably three to four years. The time is now for us. So we're going to be here from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. The so five days back to back. It's going to be super intense, but I'm really excited to see what happens. So fingers crossed. We're gathered here today to go from a brief to a campaign prototype in just five days. With everyone working together, it sounds chaotic, but actually it's a pretty controlled process. And we make it fun, because it can be pretty chaotic. Day one is essentially, oh my god, there's so much to learn, there's so much I don't know, let's do this. It's not gonna be easy for them, but I think it's a learning curve and it really, really accelerates the process of doing a three-month campaign in five days. God bless you guys and good luck. <laughs> if I would describe this day so far, intense. The way that uh, Kubo has done it, doing kind of local talent uh, and bringing local talent into the experience, uh, this is what's completely unique uh, and very cool to what they've done. We're only a few hours through day one. The morning was kind of gentle. Things have very much accelerated in the last two hours. I feel there's no better way to get into it than just by throwing everything at us immediately. Another five hours of this, your mind will explode. We've been rotating in groups to come up with ideas on different, uh, from different angles. And sometimes you see you're sitting, you don't know what to say, you don't have inspiration. But suddenly in another group, out of nowhere, you see like this brilliant idea. We had some of the wildest ideas come to life. Today's structure was much easier for the creative people in the room to actually express themselves and be able to develop things that they might have not been able to do yesterday. Whittling it down, admittedly, I must say, um, there were some ideas that got lost in that process that I was bit like, oh man. And I think that was actually a really good thing for us to just fully push the boat out. And then obviously there's just that whole idea of less is more. <laughs> Love it. Well done, oh, team. Okay. Oh, so Day three is about making decisions, which is very hard. You have to look at many, many things and say, I want just that one, and we'll have to drop everything else. So it takes a lot to do that. Uh, when you're in a room together, of course, the hive mind gets really strong. Ideas can flow around all the amazing creatives, but realistically, you also need outsiders, the real users, the real consumers from a diverse range, uh, so that the ideas can get filtered down, and of course, the, the silly ones that we thought were great can get removed, and the ones that are actually gonna make an impact uh, beyond just our creative bubble can actually become reality. To be honest, we've actually just killed about, from 140 ideas, we're down to four. So a lot of, as we say, kill your babies. A lot of babies have been killed in this process. Day four is about saying, we need to build a car. We don't have anything to build it with. You only see parts on the floor and you have to start putting it together. Oh, wait, like that, is that? <laughs> We're sitting here, the client, while the creative teams are in another room. Um, and we're expecting to see uh, interesting stuff. We're about to shoot our ad prototype. So a little bit of production work on the go, ad hoc style, you know, we're making it quick, dirty and fun. Still don't know how we're gonna get this edited and done and polished by 4 p.m. Day five is about seeing all of these parts that were on the floor starting to form into a shape of a car that you couldn't quite tell what it was. And then you step back and you say, oh, I thought it was gonna be a Golf, but it's a Tesla. I'm very excited about it. It's day five and I'm in the garden. We've sold the idea, the client is happy. 
and we've got four hours to bring everything together for a big presentation to the entire company. But I'm going to lie here for two more minutes. It was super intense. I think it was the most intense sprint I've ever done in my life. And there were moments there where it was touch and go, but I'm super proud of the team and everybody and myself for everything that we've accomplished. So I guess looking back over the last five days, I'd say it's, uh, it's been a roller coaster. It always is. Um, and at the end, I think everyone is uh, enormously happy um, and not just relieved, but genuinely excited about what comes next.